Hello, I'm Martin and I would like to show you a quick demo of the new ADIC 3.0. This is the new home screen of the application. Today I will show you the new search screens. This is the original main screen of the old ADIC, but simplified. ADIC now automatically detects the type of search phrase and will also automatically try to deinflect verbs. To demonstrate this, let's type tabenai. OK, only once search result is displayed. Note that a long click has been changed and we'll now perform selection of items. You can do various actions with uh, selected items depending on the context. For example, this button will add uh, the entries to the notepad. OK, back to the search. Let's display entry details. The detail screens are now organized in tabs. First tab uh, will show the, the dictionary entry itself. This data comes from the new JMD dictionary file, which is more verbose than uh, the old edict uh, file. Next tab uh, shows all kanjis present in the entry. Long link uh, works here as well. You can select both uh, kanjis and add them to the notepad. OK. The examples tab will show the Tatoeba example sentences. Finally, the inflection tab will show all verb inflections. OK, let's display kanji details. The cache details is now shown with a different set of tabs. The radicals tab will display information about all kanji radicals. You can try to draw the kanji by clicking on the stroke or the diagram. OK, uh, third tab will display all occurrences of the kanji in, in uh, the JM Dick dictionary. Finally, the examples tab will show uh, the example sentences. Note uh, then that you can uh, add anything to the notepad, including the example sentences. OK. Finally, I will show you uh, the example sentence drill down. Let's see uh, the first example sentence. A different set of tabs is displayed. You can see the sentence in itself in the first tab. OK. Uh, the kanji tab displays all kanjis present in the example sentence. Finally, the analysis tab uh, contains a drill down to each word in a sentence. Okay, I hope you like the presentation. Thanks for watching.